We're checking out the latest viral Fortnite moments and seeing how Fortnite messed up, but it's actually a good thing. Starting off with a bot that opens a chest through the ceiling. Are you kidding me? Imagine a bot. Well, I can actually, the bot opened the chest for him, technically. And hopefully, he can also get himself an easy kill. But opening through walls, that's OP. Default Spectra Knight was actually hinting at what the superstars would be with the gold, blue, and white. Honestly, some of the best superstars we've had. Maybe the rainbow ones during the Marvel season were the best, but anything gold is awesome in my books. If you did not know, Eminem is getting three skins. I'm not sure why celebrities get more than one icon skin. Look, I'm not complaining. My skin is like eight styles, but Lewis Hamilton got two. The tennis player got two. Eminem's got three. I'm not quite sure how that works out. Maybe they just sell really, really well, but these skins will be dropping in the item shop on the 29th of November. So make sure you pop code Ali A in. What are these lobbies? I'm not even good at the game. You've got Tim him, courage, ninja, and cypher in your game. Oh my gosh, bro. Good luck playing against those guys. This is crazy, by the way. I'm literally running. Be careful. That's the deadliest shadow. Fortnite still has death spots on the map. So watch this. Watch this. <laughs> what? Bro. What? These spots used to exist on the OG Fortnite map. I had no idea that they'd still exist now. Maybe it's like accidentally thinking you're under the map and just killing you. Their whole lobby died. I'll be fuming, mate. Fortnite update me house was in the mode that aren't 12 plus. Cover up his nipples. Can't be showing them in a video game for kids. Good thing is Fortnite have actually reverted like blocking loads of skins and will be altering skins later down the line so they can be usable in all different modes. I don't know what Fortnite were thinking to be honest with you, but this is hilarious. This is a really good comparison of the Fortnite map. Like the actual OG map versus what we got. Look how much more ice there is. There's the volcano. Oh, my favorite landing spot was on this pirate ship right here, actually. We even had the old area where players submitted parts of the map and it would get added in. I'll be honest, Loki, I actually think I prefer the OG version versus the real OG version. But let me know what you think. I'm not built for ranked. Hand cannon straight to the head, mate. That's savage. This person set up a bounce pad in a room with a load of loot. Surely you want to pick up... What? Oh my gosh. Bro just got taken down. These lobbies are sweaty in OG Fortnite. Oh, but wait. This person's now going over to where the other player was killed. Oh, there was a trap on the ceiling. <laughs> Did everybody just forget about this gun? I don't know why people say that. The burst was in the game, but only for the first week of OG Fortnite. It obviously looked like the Famous, like it had a different visual to it. But that's the case with a lot of the guns in OG Fortnite. So they didn't forget about it. This wasn't in the game for very long. Using this emote with Bender is something else. <laughs> What? How has that gotten its way into Fortnite? Okay, this is genuinely a crazy clip. This is like proper OG Fortnite, by the way. You can tell by the UI. They're sky basing up to the top. Weirdly using, I think, cones that have been edited to be like ramps, which a lot of people did back in the day when building wasn't very easy when you were playing with a controller. Sky basing over to the middle of the map. And what happens next is definitely like one in a million. I don't know how they got this lucky. Still sky basing, still sky basing. And then boom, get shot down, falling to their death, lands on a random tire on another person's base, eyes off the shotgun, teammates down. Can he clutch up? Can he clutch up? Let's go, baby. One taken down, two taken down. He's a hero. Wait, 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 wait. So, if you guys have seen this image here, Lego themselves have started to tease the collab between Lego and Fortnite. This person went ahead and made instructions, I think just off their own back, as to how you can make the llama yourself. I don't have all of these colored pieces, but dude, if I could find these pieces, I could make myself the Lego llama right now. Are you ready? Boom! That is so cool. How do you feel about Epic adding mythic or exotic skins? Ooh, it's a good point. We've never gone above legendary skins. I never thought about that. Mythic or exotic skins would be sick. I mean, mythic alone look incredible. But I mean, they'd cost so much money, right? What would it end up being? My game glitched and caused me to break everything I touch. I don't know what to do. 
I feel like this has to be a bug connected to the zip wire. <laughs> Normally, the zip wire is above your head, though, for this glitch. But, I mean, this is probably the most powerful person in Fortnite right now. Literally the Hulk. Just run through walls. See an enemy? See them build? Just run at them, mate. Everything gets destroyed. Truck? Destroyed. I want to see him do this in the battle. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Boom, 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 boom. Break everything. Down it falls. <laughs> and it killed him from full damage. <laughs> nah, that's too OP. Future weapons we'll be using with a new E-rated system in Battle Royale. Bubble gun block. Yo, not even joking. Bubble gun weapon? I mean, I don't know how you can make it feel damage, but if, if you can make it work, that'd be a sick weapon in Fortnite. How hard is it? Oh, dude, my favorite POI. I love landing at this pirate ship. Didn't return. The volcano. You know what? I actually wasn't the biggest fan of this just because how tall and annoying it was to go up and down it, but an iconic part of the map in chapter one. Happy Hamlet. Can't lie, never landed here, although I know a lot of people absolutely loved it. Neo tilted. Also gotta admit, wasn't the biggest fan of the Neo areas on the map, so I'm not too bothered about these not returning. The football pitch. Fun fact, I think this was only in the game. Back in like the 2018 World Cup for like a week or something. So if they did bring this back, I would have been really surprised. That's not the only things they didn't bring back. And I'm actually quite happy about it. The first one's obviously with the most recent update with the season nine and season X island coming to the game. We didn't get mechs. Thank goodness. No offense to everyone that loves mechs, but those things are super annoying. And in no build mode, even more so ridiculous. Although mechs have been reintroduced and not made quite as strong as they were initially in chapter one season X, but either way, never bring them back to the game. Let's not forget about the infinity blade, a weapon that was only in the game for like a week or less, maybe even a few days back in the original chapter one season. That also didn't return. And although this hasn't been a perfectly accurate version of what chapter one Fortnite was like, I genuinely think with a new movement, with the rotating weapon pools and everything else that they did. OG Fortnite has been incredible. And I'm going to enjoy this final week, man, because I'm going to be so sad when it goes. Talking of things that won't be around for long, there is huge Black Friday deals going down right now for this weekend on Turtle Beach products, headsets, accessories, and more. You may have noticed me wearing my brand new Turtle Beach Stealth Pro headset, genuinely the best gaming headset I have ever owned, with incredible noise cancellation, amazing sound quality and settings that can be fully customized right from your phone. Take advantage of these huge discounts for this weekend only over on the Turtle Beach website. These discounts range from the Stealth 600 headset up to the Stealth 700 and all the way up to the headset that I'm using, the Stealth Pro headset. I'll leave a link in the description and remind you guys at the end. But if you're looking for a new headset, maybe for Christmas, now is the time to buy it whilst the deals are on. So don't miss out. Tootsie Slide got a kid friendly version. What the? Did they make a kid bot version of this emo? But Fortnite's gonna be so different once they introduce all these changes. What a shot. Oh, I gotta see this. Guy's got barely any loot. Just a clinger to his name. Gone. Go on. Oh! Oh! That is so satisfying. Not a bad pickup for $5. There's a downloadable backlink. I don't know if I've got this. So you get all of these Monopoly pieces as backlinks. Bro, that is a lot of unlocks. I don't think I have this. I go to backlink and search Scott. Oh, oh, what the hell? I do have it. I feel like Fortnite may have given this to me. I have definitely never bought Monopoly set. Wait, there's a T-Rex? Bro, are you telling me I can have a T-Rex backlink this whole time? Oh my gosh, I need to use these more often. The item shop is finally expensive expanding beyond just one single page. If there is anything OG or anything you pick up in here that you don't have already with the final week of Fortnite, you've obviously got M&M coming to the item shop. Again, big thank you to everyone that pops code Ali A and it does only take a few seconds. And shout out to everyone that picked up my locker bundle, which included the Rock Rift. And I hadn't been in the game for over 1,500 days. If you missed it, I'm sorry, you'll probably never return. New weaponry textures, Nerf guns. Bro, honestly, why haven't they done Nerf wraps in Fortnite? That actually would make so much sense. I mean, Nerf guns are so popular in Fortnite anyway. They'd be so cool as wraps on weapons. Bush is actually OP. <laughs> nah, there's no way, bro. There's a glowing gold skin in the bush. How does he not... Re He's a galaxy skin. My man's got a super rare OG skin and can't spot people in bushes. That's how OP the bushes is. Are you kidding me? I have an employee exclusive Fortnite PD basketball signed by Donald Mutton. Bro, that is every 
Fortnite fans dream. Healy basketball and Donald Mustard sign. That's incredible. Cleanest shots hit with a hand cannon, bro. I love hand cannon shots. There's nothing more satisfying than landing like a one hit shot with what is a pistol, basically. Just having your reticule. Ooh, great hit. Ooh, that's nice. Let's go. All right, this is even more cracked. Check this out. Yeeting up on a hoverboard. Got the hunting rifle in hand. That's nasty, bro. That is nasty. Told my laggy friend to drive the shopping cart and it duplicated. There are two sets of... What the? What? Two shopping carts in one? How laggy is your friend's internet? What are the odds of this? Oh, this was like peak, peak, chapter one Fortnite. Crazy rare supply drop landing on top of each other clickbait. And honestly, it is really rare. It's still cool to see to this day. Does not happen very often. So it's exactly one week until the Big Bang live event. I'll be streaming it here on my channel. So make sure you subscribe to tune in and not miss anything. And yes, it will be featuring Eminem, Lego, and more. It's gonna be crazy. Guys, don't don't forget to check out the Black Friday deals this weekend only on the Turtle Beach website. I'll leave a link in the description and click on screen here to watch another Fortnite video. I'll see you over there.